Hi, I'm Brian from Syntax Technologies. You can contact me with this information. We'll continue with our SQL Accounting System training and in today's lesson, I'll talk about View of Material, VOM. So let's go to SQL. VOM is an additional module, so you need to add on to your existing SQL even though you are SQL Pro version. To do that, the first thing you need to do is when you maintain your stock item, you need to maintain all your finished good and also the raw material. VOM normally will use by company or manufacturer that need to do assembly of item. For example, you have an item called VOM. Okay, this item it need to be assembled by using different type of raw material. So we go to VOM tab. You can see that to make one unit of VOM, you need to have one unit of ANT, one unit of CPIE 100, and also three unit of cover. Okay, you can always change the or edit the raw material accordingly or change the quantity. Now, one thing to take note is please remember to change the info over here from stock to become VOM if this is a finished good. You can put in the production time and assembly cost also. Now, how, how it works? Basically, imagine there's one customer come in and want to buy 3,000 units of VOM from you. So you go and check. Oh, my quantity on hand is actually 2,003 units. So I do not have enough VOM to sell to my customer. I need to produce or assemble another 1,000 units of VOM. So let's go to production, go to VOM planner, go to VOM code select the VOM and you need to assemble maybe 1000 unit so apply by using a view of material planner you can actually know that to assemble this 1000 item 1000 unit of VOM what is the raw material I required so you require 1000 ANT 1000 CPRE 1000 and on hand what is the quantity on hand so you can see that obviously it's not enough for you to assemble so you need to make purchase of all this raw material so assuming you do the purchasing part and you receive the uh, raw material then you need to do the assembly so what you do just go to production go to stock item assembly okay go to new now we are doing assembly now so you want to assemble this item VOM how many quantity 1000 so you can see that the system will auto calculate for you okay of course if during the during the uh, assembly if there is any wastage for example there will be wastage of ANT let's say 100 you just click on the wastage okay so you save it by doing this alone the system will actually deduct 1000 of ANT 1000 of this CPRE deduct 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 and increase the quantity of BOM by 1000 so this is how assembly work of course in the real life productions it will not work in this way because there is a recorded work in progress there is lead time there is different phase of productions so it's not as simple as just click one button the stock increase and raw material decrease so this is how far um, our level or SQL accounting system can go so how it helps if I do not have if you do not have the BOM module okay so can I still use SQL or what is the way to use SQL in this type of scenario is you need to have the stock module where you need to do a stock receive of the finished good in just now the case is you need to do a stock receive of 1000 unit of BOM and stock issue that is the decrease of quantity issue out a raw material so still can use by using stock receive and stock issue okay 
so no big problems so it depends whether which way you want and do you need to add on the module or not so this is how BOM works if you do have time please drop by at my Facebook it's facebook.com slash syntax technologies okay then you can like my Facebook you can you have all the latest information regarding uh, SQL and also GST uh, in the other hand you might want to go to my website is syntax.com.my click on the YouTube and then here is all the other SQL tutorial video that's all for today and once again I'm Brian from Syntax Technologies thank you